Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. As you guys can tell by the title, I'm back with another Marshalls and Ulta haul. And this is not like a huge one or anything, but I got some really cute stuff, so I definitely want to show you guys. If I sound a little sick or something, it's because my allergies are currently kicking my butt. But I still wanted to do this video for you guys because I love doing hauls and I think you guys like them too. So yeah, before we jump into this video, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe and let's go ahead and get into this stuff so we have a pretty decent amount of items from ulta as well as marshall's i think i will start off with ulta so i didn't buy that much makeup from ulta i just got like beauty products but it was stuff that i really really needed so i'm gonna show you guys so first up i've been really obsessed with camille rose um hair care products so i picked up the herbal tea seal and soften leave-in conditioner so this is what it looks like it looks like very watery but their products work really good in my hair as well as Ari's hair so I've been buying a lot of their stuff like I just been buying their stuff and their stuff only lately and then I also bought their Moroccan pear conditioning custard this stuff works really good when it comes to like hydrating and keeping your curls looking healthy I feel like this does a really good job at that and really quickly jumping back to this um leave-in conditioner i also have the milk one and the honey one those ones work really good and that's what made me want to try the herbal tea so that's why i picked this up i actually have their products in my hair right now they work really good and then i went ahead and picked up their grow grease and this is what it looks like it smells really really good the next thing i got are these kiss gel fantasy nails and um this is what they look like kind of remind me of the bare but nude but these have a little more color to it and i want to tell you guys what the name of it is but i don't know where to find it um eight two nine five seven is the number at the top i don't know as you guys can see i'm in need of some nails right now so put those on the next thing i picked up is this bio oil this is the whole reason why i went to ulta because i've been using the i've been using this product on my stretch marks and it keeps them from itching and stuff like that especially like now that i'm at the end of my pregnancy they're like my stretch marks are done with me so i went ahead and picked up a bottle of this and i'll be using this postpartum as well so i went ahead and picked up a decent sized bottle the little bottles actually last me quite a long time so i'm pretty sure this is gonna last me a good amount of time and it's good for 36 months so it won't expire on me and then the last three things that i got are makeup related first thing that's kind of boring i'm gonna get out the way is the morphe m173 brush i just have my eye on this brush and i just wanted to try it i feel like it'll be good for blending concealer underneath the eyes and then I picked up the NYX This Is Juice Gloss in Blueberry Mood. And then the last thing that I picked up from Ulta is the ColourPop Cheek Palette in Such A Rush. This is the deep one. And let's go ahead and take a look and see what this looks like. That looks very pretty. Let's go ahead and swatch it. Ooh, that feels nice. Look at that. And then we have this color here. Oh, I'm impressed. Like, it feels so soft. Here are the swatches. My swatches are not that good, but I'm going to tell you guys, this formula is super nice. Like, it feels so soft. I can't wait to try this out. So, I went ahead and picked that up. And that is everything that I got from Ulta. A very small but expensive haul because curly hair products you're gonna you're gonna pay for it okay so now jumping into marshall's the first thing that i got is the bh cosmetics dance brush set y'all i've been wanting this i did not want to pay full price for this and i'm so glad i didn't because i got this for 14.99 and let me just show you guys Put this beautiful little bag and these really pretty brushes i love the handles like how cute are those this brush set comes with 10 brushes and the makeup bag so i got this for 14.99 and i think the original price is like 30 something i have my eye on it i wasn't paying that price 
this and I'm so glad I didn't. They look much nicer for $14.99 than they would have if I would have paid $30. They wouldn't have been as cute if I would have paid $30 something dollars for them. The next thing I picked up from Marshalls are these Kiss Fantasy Nails. Look how beautiful they are. I never find Kiss Nails at Marshalls. Like I never find the cute ones, so I was really happy to see these. I actually really like blue nails. Like that was a vibe for me at one point. I used to always wear blue nails and these were only $4.99. So I feel like this was a good buy. The last two things that I got are palettes, of course. Both palettes that I got are from Rude Cosmetics. I've actually been wanting to try these and I kind of want to compare them to the Cara Beauty palettes. This one is the Freshly Cut palette. And let's open it up and see what she looks like. So, so pretty. I'm gonna swatch just a couple of shades. Cause, ooh, it swatched pretty nicely. So I'm excited to try out this formula. Again, this palette is just so cute. The last one that I got is the Potpourri palette. And this one is giving fall vibes, end of summer fall vibes. And let's go ahead and swatch a few of these as well. Here are some swatches. So pretty. I kept seeing people post that they found these palettes at Marshalls and TJ Maxx. And I was like, okay, if I find them, I'm gonna get them because they look so pretty. And I got the two that I was able to find and I'm so happy about it. My camera battery died on me and I'm not sure where I left off. But I know I was talking about my Rude Cosmetics palettes. But yeah, I think these palettes are so cute and I'm glad I was able to pick them up for only $10 each. But that is everything that I got. I really hope you guys enjoyed this little haul. And if you did, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button. And I'll see you guys in my next video.